Hey Sagittarius, I am sorry. This is part two to your Juice for Life reading, November the 8th, 2023. I'm sorry guys, the camera, my phone is, is full of storage. I had to get my old phone out. Um, and you see that it's not a lot of, you can't see all the cards here, okay? So I'm sorry guys, but we're gonna continue on. Um, but yeah, Sagittarius, coming out here, like I said, there is an ending here, end of a chapter here. And I see there's a lot of achievement for you in a situation. So if you're working very hard at a job here, Sagittarius, or on your business aspect, I see things that's working out for you, okay? Um, I see that also you guys are being noticed here. Like there's some wishes and things that you've been praying for, um, that you've been hopeful for is now coming true. Um, there's an end of a chapter and there's a new here. Um, even though it seems like some of you guys may be going through some type of hurt pain here, um, even though that's, this is happening, that some type of chapter is ending, you're leaving a job or going to a new place or whatever, you're embarking on something new, Sagittarius, with the Page of Wands. There's something new here for you, okay? Um, also, Sagittarius, I see that the sun is here, Leo's energy, where you're going to be excited and happy with this energy that's coming in all right freedom here we have autumn magic here it says it's time to let go of something that has served its purpose and make space for newness here um you're maturing Sagittarius you're letting go here you're preparing yourself for um and being grateful for the things that's coming here Sagittarius okay um also we have renewal here there's a powerful inner transformation inside of you Sagittarius you're leaving old flames at this time you're embracing the new okay and that's what the world is um, releasing up energy of emotions here, Sagittarius, and embracing the new. Because I see that you guys may be very emotional here, all right? But you, is now it's time to embrace the new, Sagittarius. And the key word for today has definitely been patience, okay? Which I know y'all don't want to hear. All right, so coming out, we have pivot here. All right, pivot. Okay, um, sometimes when things aren't falling into place after trying and trying, okay, uh, it's time to ask yourself if pivoting is some way would be a great a good idea so that your life can flow more easily and effortless effortlessly. How could you pivot even just a little bit, huh? What pivot can you do to, to make things easier for you? Then we have bravery here. You're being asked to make tough decisions that you're being putting off because of fear, which is understandable. But you ha you do have the strength and bravery to make this decision, and you will feel so much lighter when you do. I don't know, Sagittarius. There's a decision that you make where you something needs to be cut out. Um, there's a decision that needs to be made where you're leaving something in the past and embrace a new. But it's it it calls break bravery here. Okay, Sagittarius. Um, you may be feeling stagnant at this time. This is a moment to stand still to work on one self improvement here and personal growth. Um, rooted, look deeper into the situation in your life and hold firm to what you know to be true here, okay? All right, Sagittarius. So it's all about guidance, open mind, it's protection today, and confidence here with the raven, raven, panther, zebra, and armadillo. Let me read this. You are moving forward with the chariot energy at the bottom of the deck, Sagittarius. You may be traveling a small distance here this week or having a weekend getaway that you're planning, all right? So you're encouraged to disconnect from the physical or materialistic plan and move to the spiritual realm. You have a deep spiritual connection, which you mustn't ignore. You are on the brink of transformation and your divine purpose may be revealing it. So you are encouraged to disconnect from the physical. There's something spiritual about you that's deep inside you, Sagittarius, that needs to come out and you, you've been ignoring this, Sagittarius, okay? Um, Panther here, all right, guidance. So it's time to release your passions here, live your dreams, and begin a new chapter in your life. There's that world, the end of a new chapter and starting of new. You are encouraged to expand your awareness, eliminate fears, and become a whole new person. You are guided and protected. So it's time for you to shed that old skin. It's time for you to become this whole new person that you are. Um, it's time to release your passions here, okay? So zebra here, open mindness, Sagittarius. There's no, there's more than one way of looking at things. You must be ready to accept alternative viewpoints and new ideas. You must open your eyes to new ideas and new ways of resolving problems. So maybe there's an issue in your life, Sagittarius, and you don't have to, you know, deal with that same issue the same way that you've been dealing with. Now it's time to pivot in a different direction, handle the new way, Sagittarius, okay? We got armadillo. You are protection, protection here. 
you're you're entering into a phase where in order for you to be in alignment with your intentions and co-create your best life, you may have to be discerning and stay and say no to many things that have been holding you back in the past. So whatever is holding you back in the past, Sagittarius, where it's, it's not allowing you to shed the skin to um, become this new person that you are, Sagittarius, it's time to say no to the past and embark on the new, okay? I apologize for the video cutting off, Sagittarius. This has been your Juices of Life reading for today, um, November 8th. Just remember that energy is fluid. Like the video, guys. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell. It is totally free. It doesn't hurt you at all, Sagittarius. Um, thank you guys for being here. I appreciate each and every one of you. Take care and have a blessed day, Saggy. Bye.